Throughout this spring, you've likely heard us CNY Central First Alert meteorologists talking about our rainfall deficit and how much rainfall we need in order to get back on track, so to speak. Well, over an inch of rain fell at the Syracuse Hancock Airport Tuesday, 1.09 inches to be exact. That breaks the old record of 1.04 inches of daily rainfall set back in 1971. As you can probably imagine, this significantly chopped away at our springtime rainfall deficit, reducing it to a mere two-tenths of an inch. Now, just why is this so important? I asked Jason Fridley, assistant professor in the Syracuse University Biology Department, that very question. And that's really important this time of year because plants use the water for a number of different things, even more importantly than we use it for. So plants use water, for example, like we do. It's the primary constituent of their cells in their cytoplasm, just like it is for you and me. We're mostly waters and most of the time so are plants. Plants also have some unique needs for water. They can't make food without water. If plants can't make food, Fridley says there are larger consequences. So no water this time of year means essentially uh, no productivity. Our systems would, would kind of slow down. There'd be no new carbon in the system. And then all the animals that rely on that food source uh, would be out of luck. With that understanding, it's safe to say our recent rainfall has been very beneficial. Reporting from Syracuse, I'm CNY Central. First alert, meteorologist Matt Stevens.